I'm Mary Carey, the porn star, and I'm here with my mommy. Her name is Judy. Say hi, mommy. Hi. <laughs> this is my grandmother, Lee. Wave. Wave at the camera. Say. <laughs> and <laughs> we're here because my mommy's gonna go on a date with Gary. I think they're gonna like each other, right, mom? You, you yes. I think he's gonna. Yeah. Are you nervous? A little bit, but I'm excited. Now, why do you want to set your mom up with Gary? I think that my mommy should go on a date, because I don't think you've gone on a date for a long time, right? Yeah, but no. And I think that this would be really good for her. I think they might have, like, a lot of things in common. He seems like a nice guy. I want to have a nice guy. Maybe mommy will have sex. You never know, right, mommy? Yeah? Right. Do you want to? I gotta get to know him first. <laughs> what about with your blanket? What do you do with that? I'll tell you, for years I was so, I didn't have anybody in my life that I'd actually masturbate with a blanket. Can you believe that? I rubbed a blanket on me. Okay. I, you did it to me when I was little, you said, but... I, I used to tell that. her when she was one, two, I used uh -oh. to yell, um, sex with your blanket, <laughs> when she was one and two. What uh, about you, Nana? What do you have to say? Anything? My husband died. <laughs> what are you hoping he's going to look like? Well, I hope he's good looking, but even if he's not, you know, to me, looks are dead, of course. It's what's inside that counts. If the person's nice and kind and, and sweet and honest and considerate and gentle, that's all I care gentle. about. <laughs> oh, that's not nice, my God. <laughs> Gary, what's going on today? I'm supposed to be the girl here. Oh, yeah? For what? I, I don't know, for a date, I guess. So we're setting you up on a date today? Yeah, that's what they said. Cool. What, so what do you hope she's going to be like? I hope it's what I mean out in the hallway. The one with the blonde. I like her better. You like her? Yes. Why do you like her? Because she's sexy. <laughs> All right, we're minutes away from bringing in Mary Carey, the porn star, whose retarded mother and slow grandmother are here. Howard, yeah. I tell you, we've seen everything, and you have not seen anything like this. We're just, everyone's buzzing out there. Really? It's like a John Waters movie. It's so, it's so surreal. But um, uh, Grandma wanted coffee, yeah. and she wanted a coffee with two sugars, yeah. so they brought it to her. And I don't think she drank the coffee, but I believe she ate the sugars. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Mary Carey is a, a porn star, and uh, she was raised by a retarded mother and a slow grandmother. It was but, but, the slow grandmother who ate the sugars? Yeah, but yeah, even that's... She a, ate the, she's slow. But even that's a dispute now, because Mary was just telling me that the retarded mom babysits the grandma when she goes on the road. Oh, my goodness. I don't know. What's that like? It's all very, very confusing. I was going to do a couple of show notes here, but I think maybe it's time to just bring them in. I can see Casey's <laughs> chomping at the bit. Yeah, I don't think wait. I can wait. Yeah. This was scheduled for a month from now, and I said, bring them in now. <laughs> uh, here she is, Mary Carey, the porn star. Oh you can see she looks a little that. like Mariah Carey. That's how she got the name Mary Carey. Uh, there's mom and grandma. Oh, my goodness. All right, sit everyone down. It'll take a second to get everyone seated. I can tell that. Nice to see you, ladies. Nice to see you. How are you? Uh huh. Yeah. All right, Mary Carey, take a seat. Help Grandma, uh, Gary. Nana, please. Nana, sit down. You all right. Here's her sugar. Here's her sugar. <laughs> She's still with the sugar. Your grandma has some sugar. Yeah, she loves to eat sugar. Don't laugh. Is that okay? How is this? <laughs> Sorry. She laughs like Mariah Carey. No. I just laugh every day. Everywhere I go, I laugh. That's it. Put Grandma's uh, headphones on so she can hear me. <laughs> she probably saw There you go. Does Grandma know where you are? Yeah, she sees me. Okay. Grandma, I'm over here. What would I be? <laughs> All right. Mary Carey, you uh, gave yourself the name Mary Carey, that is your porno name, because yes. you look a little like Mariah Carey. Yeah, I always get that, and then also, well, my real name is Mary, so. Right. So oh, you became Mary, Mary Carey. Carey. Yeah. Mary, how old are you, may I ask? 21. 21 years old. How long have you been in the porno business? Um, well, about a year in that, and then, like I started doing stuff, though, like when I was 19. I see. So. And mom, do you know what the porno business is? No. No. You don't? Have you ever seen porno? No. Did you ever ask your daughter how she makes money? No. What do you think she does? I always thought she just walked around looking pretty, looking <laughs> real good, real, looking very, um, just very pretty, very demure, very fancy. There you go. Very nice. <laughs> and um, uh, where is your husband? My husband is, is gone. He's, 
were divorced. <laughs> really? So you were married. Mary yeah. Carey has a... Uh, You're married twice. Yes, I was legally married twice. I see. Were you married to Mary's father? Yes. Okay. Okay. And was it difficult raising a daughter? It was, but luckily I had the help of this woman, my mother, Mary Ellen's grandmother, and my grandfather. So is that right? Man, not my grandfather, oh. but Mary Ellen's grandfather. All right. So, so your your so Lee, that is your name, Lee, Grandma. Leona. Leona. <laughs> Leona, how are you? Fine. Fine. Uh, are you aware that uh, Mary Carey is a porno star? I didn't think she was. No. Right. Do you know what that means? Yeah, I guess. I don't know. What right. does that mean? What does it mean? Mom, what do you think it means? What does it mean? You tell me. <laughs> well, uh, Mom, what do you think? I always thought it just meant... I'm pretty sure... I'm getting the impression now that it means um, walking around like in your underwear or bikinis or even naked. Right. Uh -huh. Okay, well, you've got it then. Close, it. Yeah, anyway. Right, yeah. I mean, yeah. it's more right. than just walking around. That's pretty much it. As a mom, do you approve of what Mary Carey does? Yes, I approve. I really approve. I approve a lot. I really do. <laughs> you love your daughter. I love my daughter. I'll back her up with whatever she does. I'll back her up. Okay. Even well, as a porn star. Mary, was it hard for you that, uh, 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 Mom? You were you were in, when you were in school. Were you in the special class of some kind? Actually, no. But the only thing, only thing that did was that just that the kids gave me. I wasn't in a special class, but in high school, the kids gave me a hard time. They they did. Me. You they graduated from high school. Yes, from a, in a regular class in a regular school in a regular class. Yay, mommy! Right, and and then <laughs> did everyone, your parents and such, your mom, did everyone say don't have children? You're not bright enough to have children. Did a lot of people try to dissuade you? They did say that but you know I got the impression that my relatives and the people that knew me were against me being pregnant when I first got pregnant that they didn't feel it was good but the relatives didn't dare say one word because they knew that they get the wrath of my mother of Lena my mother would have um I would have jumped on them if they would have said that why is she having kids but they didn't say nothing I see were they afraid you couldn't take care of your kid they probably were afraid I couldn't take care of them that that I that you know, like I say, Suffolk would have my husband. I couldn't afford the kid, you know. And well, I also, Mommy, Daddy me. daddy was mentally handicapped. He wasn't mentally handicapped. He just he couldn't talk much good at all. Right. Well, yeah. how did you two realize you were in love? <laughs> well, he, he just seemed to, he just said he, that I made him happy, that, that he loved me. And that, he used to tell me a big lie. He told me he wanted me for 50 years, and it turned out to be only a year. Right. He left me for his old wow. girlfriend. I mean, you know. How did Daddy talk, though? That's what's so funny. He called, my name is Richard. Mary Carey, did you ever meet your father? Um, Yes, I did. Up until I was about five. You know, I right. I remember he used to have visitation, but I used to hide from him and stuff. Yeah. Was, I mean, I thought my, well, my grandmother and my grandfather were my parents. Yeah, yeah. I noticed you giggle a lot when your mom yeah, talks. Are you I, embarrassed by your mom? No, I just think it's so funny. Do you, you think like, it's funny or are you oh, just a little uptight? Did the kids make fun of you because your mom wasn't the fastest one on the oh, block? No, not at all, actually. I was, right. you know, I went to a really good private school. and um, Private school? Really? I did, yeah. I got 11-10 on my SATs. You got 11-10 on the yeah. SAT, so you're no dope. Not at all. No, you're a smart girl. Very and smart. there's nothing wrong with your grandmother and grandmother? Um, well, my grandmother right now has um, Parkinson's, oh. and um, they thought maybe early Alzheimer's or that she was just going see now. She and your grandma's like dressed like a Playboy bunny. Are yes. you? Were you ever a Playboy bunny in your earlier days? No. No, you're not. Why are you dressed like a Playboy bunny? <laughs> that was his, her idea. Oh, it was her idea. She dressed you. Well, she normally dresses herself in huh. pretty, usually schoolgirl skirts. Like, my clothes from when I was about 14, she puts on. Really? It's a very sexy outfit. Grandma, are yeah. you still sexually active? Not really. No. <laughs> When's the last time you had a man? My grandfather. I think. When did he go? Oh, right. When I was 16. 16. Oh, yeah, see. so then right. that's when my grandmother started going down the hill. and right. So I pretty much was taking care of my grandmother and going to school. All right. So so, so when did you get the idea to become a porno star? Um, Well, I had seen an ad for um, something called The Girl's House when I was 19. I did right. that. Yeah. And then um, I always I always liked to you know perform and everything and dance. So then I had you know danced in strip clubs and stuff. Were you ever sure your mother one of your films? 
Um, I'll show her like dancing and stuff. See, I want to. I like normal. I do like some mainstream stuff. I did Miss Cleo commercial I see. and um, some music videos and everything. Right. Okay. And, and are you making a lot of money? Yeah, I am. Actually, tonight I was thinking I was going to bring my uh, my mom to Bada Bing with me. I'm going to be featuring there tonight, and I thought I might bring her there. You might bring your mom and your grandma. To Bada Bing to watch me dance tonight. Really? Yeah, I'm going to yeah. be there. Um, and was it like you mother. raising your mom when you were a kid? Did you have to take care of her? Um, Take care of my mom? Yeah. Um, no, not really. No? no? I mean, she, um, you know, she was always there. I don't know. You know, she, she was there. But, and, you know, you had to help her with stuff like grocery shopping and um, counting change and... Well, now I do that with my grandma. My mom right now, pretty much the only thing I have to do is just drive her places. Because you really? take the bus everywhere and walk yes. and everything. Yeah. yeah. I see. So. Oh, she can get around. Yeah. So it's not so bad having a mother who's... Uh, are you retarded, um, uh, I mom? I love my mom. Uh, is, is that the uh, classification? Oh, I'm not retarded. To be truthful, I was diagnosed as just being... Um, a little bit schizo, and maybe I have a slight brain damage from when I was born. I see. I see. So you're brain damaged, and uh, Grandma, she's got all her marbles, or no? No. 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 All right. Not right now. I mean, I out. take care of her. All right, all right. Because Grandma doesn't have all her marbles. Right. I said, do you have all your marbles? Yes. You do? As I many do. as she can keep a hold right. of it. <laughs> Well, uh, Mary, one of the reasons you came in here, uh, and uh, how many films have you done, by the way? Um, I've done about 10. You do anal? No. You do not? No. You do stuff with other chicks? Just girls and then like one guy, really. Right now, I don't know, I'm trying to, my agent's trying to convince me to do other stuff right now. But that's like what I'm, other stuff? Like that, that really bad stuff they just said. Uh, but like, I, you know, I'm really scared just yeah. about like, you know, like I don't ever want to really maybe go and do like gangbangs or anything. Like maybe that. you should discuss with your mother whether you should be doing this stuff. I don't know, Mom. What do you think I should be doing? Do you think I should do this? Should she do anal? <laughs> no. No. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the films are a little rough, right? To explain to your mother what you're doing. I think you should tell her. Well, um, the movies are basically, you know, I get naked and then uh, have sex on camera and stuff. To be truthful, frankly, I'm not really it's against it. You know why? Because frankly, Making she's, happy. she's living vicariously. I always dreamed of being a fashion model, not like um, <laughs> underwear and having a real, real slim body. So right. if she can show off her body, that's fine. You're all right yeah, with that. And You're okay. Fine with that. Yeah, fine. Even if it means having sex on camera. Right. The sex, though, is a little, uh, that's a little strong, isn't it? A little bit strong. I'm not, I don't really approve of that. No. Ah. Well, you. When is the last time you had a boyfriend, uh, Mom? Well, to be truthful, I've had some dates over the years, just a very few, but I've never really had anybody that was seriously interested. I see. In about twenty-one years. Yeah, I was going to ask, how long did your second marriage last? You had a second husband. My first marriage was uh, was uh, wasn't Brit Mary Ellen's husband. It was a man named Don. <laughs> that lasted only about fifteen months before we separated. Then only six months after I was divorced from him, I married Mary Ellen's father, and then he left me. But I left my first husband, but the second husband left me. But ah, I see. that only lasted a We were only together a year with Mary Ellen's husband. Well, Mary I don't know father. if you... I, I know Mary Carey suggested we bring in Gary the Retard to introduce you. Yeah, I thought it would be a good date for her. I thought they might get along really well. You've seen Gary the Retard on TV? Yeah, I've seen him on TV. Do you think that your mom would be attracted to him? Um, you know, maybe. I is think he her might. type? <laughs> um, I, well, you know, Mommy says it's always what's inside that counts, right, Mom? Well, I don't think there's anything inside with this oh, guy. Oh, yeah. come on. He's a oh, sweet he's so man. Sweet. He's a sweet yeah. outside. <laughs> well, if Mom don't want him, maybe Grandma will want him. Yeah, I think that Grandma, do you want a date? Do you want I, a date, Grandma? Do you have any sexual feelings anymore? I suppose I, I could. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it was the right guy? I don't. Right. <laughs> All right, you don't. Not All right. right now. Anyway, not right, not now. right now. I guess none of the men in here are getting you <laughs> sexed up. Did you look around the room, Grandma? Did you take a good look at Artie Lang? <laughs> yeah. He's hot. Yeah. Anyway, uh, what about Artie? Do you, you have any feelings toward him, Grandma? Look. Miss? Miss, over there. Ma'am? Nana. <laughs> Nana, over there. Can you see over here? Right here? Am I attractive, you think? No. no. <laughs> Frankly, no. no. <laughs> uh, thank you. Frankly, no, you're not, Artie. Yeah, well, even <laughs> thank you for being honest. Even uh, older no, no. and slow people can get that. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, here comes Gary the Retard. Um, let's see if, uh, if there's love a love match. Sight. Let's see if there's any kind of love in the room. Boy, Gary certainly dressed for his uh, first Let's date. <laughs> hey, Gary, how are you doing? Good to see you. Is that microphone working? Well, he's not in front of it yet. See if I can get it working. There you go. There you go. There you, there you go. go. All right. Good morning. Good morning, Gary. I made it. All right. Now, you made it here all the way from Oregon. Right. And where, Mary, where does your mom live? 
Florida. We all live in Florida. Oh, you all live in Florida. Yeah. Well, it'd be a long distance. I live in Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale Florida. <laughs> you do? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Are you... You long great. <laughs> Gary, uh, let me introduce you to a very lovely woman named Judy. Right there. Hi. Hi, Judy. How are you? Pretty good. And her mother, I Lee. I out in the hallway. She's yes, cute. Yes, I saw you. Yeah, Hi. Mary Kay. <laughs> That's not who wants to date you. Yeah, no, I no. would date her instead. You want to date the door. No, my mommy. That's no, my mommy. you. No, you. See? See, we Both have a problem. <laughs> Gary, beggars can't be choosers. You ever hear that expression? No. No. All right. <laughs> now, um, let me uh, first go to uh, Lee, the grandma. Lee, you attracted to this guy at all? No. Uh, no. No. All right. <laughs> and not a love match here. Judy, what about you and uh, Gary? You see anything in him? Well, I feel he's kind of nice, but I I wouldn't want to marry him or anything. <laughs> well, no. wait a minute. We're just talking about a date. Well, maybe I'll I mean, a date. Yeah, go on a date. I think it'll be fun. A date? Are you interested in a date with him? Just like a makeout session or something. Not a makeout session. Just for lunch or breakfast or... Right. Right. Get Believe to know me, each other. she's the hottest chick you've ever been introduced to that was willing to go to dinner with you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. She's well, very just she's breakfast she's or lunch. Cute. I like the one within the fire. Yeah, she's a lot better. <laughs> oh, oh, she's no, not available. No, That's Mary. You're always <laughs> trying this to is get my out mommy, your... though. She's huh? good. That's my mommy. She's a lot oh. better. <laughs> <laughs> well, what about it, Gary? Would you like to take uh, Judy, Judy out? out to dinner? Right. Yeah. Take, don't take her too. No. Okay. Come on, you gotta go too. Well, if, I, if you guys get married, I'll be your uh, daughter. <laughs> oh, Eve. You know what? I'm clapping like you. You want to come in and live with me? Judy, let me ask you something. Was your husband about uh, kind of like Gary, speech wise? <laughs> I think he, he was brighter than Gary, but he he, he uh, talked worse, a lot worse than Gary. Did. He talked worse than yeah. Gary. So you're not turned off to this kind of guy's personality, yeah. right? <laughs> Well, Gary, I think I found you someone who at least is a, a very pretty woman. Right? Very pretty. <laughs> very pretty. Thank you. Yeah. You know what? I'm always on the internet, too, so uh, my, my new website's going to be www.com. Dot com. <laughs> www.com. That's all you have to do to get a hold of you? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. If you want to get in touch with them, just go to www.com. <laughs> oh, I got my website going already. Yeah. Uh, Judy, so you'd be willing to go to dinner with him. Yes. Are you on the internet as well? No. You She'll come on my it? site. She'll be a guest on mine. On the Mary Carey site? <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't mind, would mind seeing her. I think I see pictures of her on the computer already. Yeah, no. probably. No. She's hot. <laughs> well, Gary, I'm going to give you a bit of advice. If you want to make time with uh, Judy here, you got to stop focusing on her daughter and, and more on Judy. <laughs> really? Not, Judy, don't, yeah, you I say? I don't think yeah. Mary's interested in you, Gary. <laughs> Try to romance Judy a little bit. You'd be a nice daddy, though. You guys can get married, and it'll be fun. You would like to see your mom get married Yeah, together. I think it'd be fun. Yeah, well, Gary's always on the computer. He'd be a good husband. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm always on it 24-7. <laughs> well, so, Gary, you're not interested? Is that what you're saying? No, no, no. I'm not interested. I just like... I like the one over there, the fire. She's so the she's the porno sexual. star. We're trying to no, set you up. My, yeah, my mommy. Yeah, I'll no. stand up and model for him. Stand up and model. <laughs> you look really good. She looks look at her. Yeah. She's got a nice body. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she's she's pretty. So you want to take her to dinner, Gary? Yes, yes, no. <laughs> Casey, fix the microphone, will you? So, uh, listen, maybe it'll be a love match. Maybe it won't. I think it will be. Uh, I happen to think uh, Judy and Lee are lovely women. I think Gary'd be lucky to get either one of them. Gary right? seems to be unaware of you know where he should be looking. <laughs> I know. The woman sitting yeah. next to you, Gary, yeah. is the one who's interested. Yes. Now you're looking. All right. Now you see yep. her. She got on fishnets and a short mini skirt. I mean, what could be better than that? She got all dressed right. up for you. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> well, let me tell you something, uh, Mary Carey. Uh, we've uh, attempted a love match here. I think it'll work. Uh, guys can see you on MaryCarey.com. Mm hmm. I hope your mom and Gary hit it off. I could see that your grandma, Lee, is not interested in Gary. Um, I, I would imagine this was not an easy life for you, was it? Um, you know, no, but to me it always felt normal because that's how I was always, you know, I was always with my grandparents and they provide me with a great life. So Do you think normal. you took the life of porno because you didn't have the love of your father and perhaps there was too much pressure in your life? And I just like to be the center of attention. I just like to always, you know... Be in front of people and yeah, you know, well, perform. You're certainly getting my attention now. <laughs> yes. Um, I don't know if you're interested, but I understand that grandma and mom do an unbelievable version of uh, Farrah Jaka. <laughs> well, maybe we'll end with that. Would you guys like to do Farrah Jaka? Will you sing, Nana? Where? Right here in the microphone. Sing Farrah Jaka. Farrah Jaka, Farrah Jaka, Dormez-vous, Dormez-vous. 
Summer with Martina, Summer with Martina, ding, ding, dong. Yeah, yeah, that's great. Oh. Not bad. Nice. Uh, well, Mary Three Carey. Three generations there. You've got an interesting uh, story. You've yeah. got an interesting life. In fact, I might option it for the movie of the week. <laughs> but, Gary, good luck on your date with uh, Judy. Let's find out what happens. Keep us posted, kids. And, Lee, nice to meet you. Oh, I got something to give you before I leave. I got your coffee cup with says Oregon on it. You got a coffee cup with Oregon. You didn't bring Oregon. anything for Judy? <laughs> no, I didn't. Oh, I just thought it was... Give the coffee cup to Judy, <laughs> for God's sake. There you go. You want a coffee cup with yes. Oregon on it? Yes. Well, now you're making time. <laughs> See? Not, I just give the other to Robin. That's All right. good. Yeah, okay. give, yeah. one, give a coffee cup to Robin and one to she Judy. Needs a, she needs a toy gun on it. All right, well, there it is. The true story of Mary Carey, her mom and grandma, and Gary the Retard. And mommy will be at Bada Bing also. Oh, she will? Yeah, oh, she's she... going to come tonight. I, that's what I was told, that my mom's coming with me. Really? So, yeah. Maybe she'll come on stage. I don't know. <laughs> you don't get naked in front of people, do you? No. Would you like to? No. No. All right. Well. What do you mean, no? <laughs> well, maybe. Like, but I guess hey, you know what? I like girls when they get naked like, on the on the webcams. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yes. <laughs> She's on the web all the time. In all fact, right. You know what? In fact, if you got a computer, I got a webcam at home right now. All you have to do is click onto my name, and I can send it to you. See me on cam on the computer. I can see you naked. No. Um, <laughs> you want to see me naked? Wait, you want to see him <laughs> naked? I tell you what, I if I could go on a website and see Gary the Retard naked, I might go on you there. Might <laughs> the I might do that. All right, uh, MaryCarrie.com, thank you, thank and uh, GaryTheRetard.com, I guess it is, uh, or whatever. Uh, www.com. www.com. <laughs> www.com, all right. And we'll be back. What, what is it, Doug? Um, do you want to show the mother uh, her daughter dancing? I don't think so. No, no, no I don't think so, I could take that. I don't that. know if she actually grasps the whole concept. <laughs> well, I don't know that. <laughs> I don't know that she needs to. She's nope. going to the Bada Bing Club tonight. She'll That's see her do it. everything. Bada really. Bing tonight, Pompano. What, are you gonna be totally nude at the Bada Bing? No. Topless. Topless? Yeah. Okay. All right, we'll be back right after these words. All right, I met Gary. We're gonna go out and have a date. We have a lot in common, and, I can, and I'm really excited about it. Very happy about it. Bye. Bye. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Uh, all my, we're going out for a date. We're going out for fun. We're going to sit at the park and talk. <laughs> oh. She don't like to walk across the line. She says, "Don't walk." No, I don't like to. No. Nope. That's in New York. We got breakfast here. We're gonna go sit out the park to eat and get to know each other a little bit better. So you know, <laughs> are you glad we got breakfast here? Are you hungry? Yes. Definitely hungry, huh? Definitely. <laughs> You're hungry. I'm hungry too. Yes. I've been here since 12 o'clock last night. No prep, no breakfast, no nothing this morning. <laughs> Here, Mary, here's your breakfast. Thank you. <laughs> That's mine. Mine's right here. <laughs> Eat! You like it? I love it. I love it too. I'm hungry. Mmm! <laughs> Okay guys, so you're just finishing up breakfast. We're gonna take you around the park. We can feed the birds, you can check out their horses. No. What's the matter? I don't want with you guys. No. You don't want to go anymore? No. What's the matter? I don't like them. You don't like him? No. What happened? I thought you guys were getting along great. You just had a nice breakfast. It's just not my type. But you can't be friends? Can't you have a friendly date? No, yeah, I, don't do I don't do that. I don't do that. I don't, I don't do, know what's going on. I don't on. do friends. Let her go with my daughter. Oh, wait, this isn't going well then, huh? No. Gary, did you say something? No, I didn't say nothing to it. But you guys were getting along five minutes ago, weren't you? No, we weren't. So it was all an act on the show? Yes. You never liked him to begin with? No, I just didn't want to hurt his feelings. I felt like a stupid, you know, blankety blank fool this whole time. Gary, what's going on? He likes, he likes my daughter more than me. Let, 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 let him go with my daughter. Oh, so you hurt your feelings? Yes. Let him go with my daughter. I'm not going to put on a big goddamn lie anymore. 
Gary, do you want to apologize? I'm sorry. What's going on here? This is terrible. Did you say something mean to me? Here's your daughter. Here's here's Mary. I'm not gonna live a lie. I'm not gonna do a goddamn lie no more. I'm not gonna go with him. This, the date is finished. It but is finished. You just finished. had a nice breakfast, didn't you? You guys were Fuck talking. Fuck the breakfast. Ooh, What's going on? This is terrible. Fuck it. I am done with this damn asshole. That's it. That's it. <laughs> huh? I don't know. I don't know what the problem is. Then what? No date, no nothing. <laughs> I like the other girl better. <laughs> She's more cute and more better. Yes. Uh, there you go. All right, just in case you need an update, uh, earlier we had on uh, porn star Mary Carey, her retarded mother, and slow grandmother, Gary the Retard, hooked up. And Doug Goodstein has been on their date videotaping it for television purposes. Doug, you say the date has come to an end? We have, uh, Judy, sit down. Okay, hello? Yes. Yeah, things have gotten uh, out of control very quickly here. What happened? Uh, I, apparently, Judy was upset the entire time that Gary was hitting on Mary. Mary so Carey, the porno star's mother, Judy, was upset? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, you know, they left the studio. They were walking arm and arm down the street. They were getting along great. We took them to the park. They had a nice breakfast. And then uh, Judy sort of snapped, and she, she said, F it. I've had enough. All he keeps talking about is my daughter. And she's very, very, very fired up. She's she stormed away. We had to pull her back. And uh, I think the date's pretty much over. And Gary's sitting here. He looks a little dumbfounded. He's well, not it's not a great on. strategy to get a woman by hitting on her daughter. I mean, yeah. But yeah. isn't it like true that all guys, even if you're retarded, instead of going for the sure thing, he goes for the younger daughter? Yeah, I've done it a million times. Yes. Well, Gary, Gary's a smart guy. <laughs> uh, do you want to talk to anyone? I do. I want to first speak to uh, Gary. Okay, but he's Gary. a classic case of going yeah, Howard, I think you have two means. lines up, so you can pot up the second one. I have, uh, I have Judy over here. All right. Is the second one up? Is it working? Hey, Gary, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. Hello? Hey, Let me just talk to Gary. Gary. Oh, this is Howard. Yeah, Howard. Gary, I heard the uh, date came to an end. You can't hit on the daughter in front of the mother. I know. Why I did know you, that. Why did you insult her like that? I don't understand. I know, I just, you know, she just got mad and everything else, and everything went okay. Well, I tried to hook you up. I found you a nice woman, a woman who I thought was in pretty right. good shape, fairly attractive. You're always talking about how you want a girlfriend. Right. And what you did was you hit on her daughter the entire time. And uh, I can't help you if you're going to do that. I know. Were I you, know that. Were you not attracted to the mother? I was attracted to her. Do you want to go apologize to her? I tried, tried to do, but she, I tried, tried to do, Howard, but she wasn't accepted. All right, let me speak to uh, Judy. Okay. Judy. Here's Judy. Here's Judy. Hi, Mary. There you go. Stay, just stay seated, okay? And don't curse. <laughs> I've never been so humiliated in my life. Judy. I've never been so humiliated in my life. That's hard to believe. That, 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 that Gary was coming on to my daughter the whole time in the studio. They, these darn handicapped men, they always want to get out of their league. And I'm not retarded. I'm not, and I'm not slow. Just ask, <laughs> ask other people that know me. I've never been so humiliated in my life. No, I don't like that date. No. No, I don't like it. It wasn't hey, a Judy. good date. Hey, Judy, it was not a good date. No. Well, Judy, uh, by the way, I don't think you're retarded. Your daughter told us that you were retarded. Well, I don't know who said that, but it's not true. All right. But she's absolutely right. These handicapped men are always trying to go out of their league. That's yeah, what really said. gets me. Well, Judy, let me tell you something. I figured Gary was very lonely. Uh, your daughter told me about you. I said, what the heck? Let's fix these two guys up, see if it works out. I think you're very pretty. Uh, no. I think you're a nice woman. And the fact that Gary acted inappropriately is wrong. I agree. No, I, I'm, not, I'm not desperate for a date. I don't care if I ever date again in my whole life. If I live to be 110, I will never date any, any guy like Gary. Never. <laughs> well, I think Gary owes you an apology, doesn't he? No, I don't have to. I don't have to. Would you no, I don't have to. Would you like Gary? Would you? Uh, I would like Gary to apologize to you. Would you allow him to do that? 
Yes, and then I never want to see him again. Oh, so you wouldn't so he's even... he's a nice guy, Mom. He's nice. Uh, yeah. nice. But just because people are nice doesn't mean they're right for each other. <laughs> I thought you two would be good together. No. <laughs> Listen to Mary cackling in the background. Yeah, that's kind of a weird thing. But uh, why don't we... But she's never going to give Gary another chance, huh? <laughs> yeah. I don't I know. I don't think that's going to happen. Gary, are you there as well? Gary? I, I, like, I want to hear his apology. Well, he doesn't have to apologize. He didn't do anything wrong. He liked me, I thought. I thought he liked me. He did something wrong. Except that he liked my daughter, but that's not, that's not, that's not his fault. I, mean, I just don't like these handicapped men trying to get out of their league all the time. They act like they're God's gifts to women. <laughs> well, it's true. I mean, Gary the retard who hasn't had a date in, in ages all of a sudden is acting like Don Juan. Right. I want that one. You're absolutely right. You happen to be right, Judy. Right. I agree with you. <laughs> well, the date is over. I still love you, Gary. I'm too good for him. I am too good for him. You are. <laughs> Someone's got to slap Mary. <laughs> Ma Mary just laughs the entire time at her mother. It's terrible. What? Doug? Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, 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 Gary, are you going to apologize or not? I was trying to apologize to Howard, but she wasn't accepted. Go ahead. Do it again. I did. I did, but she wanted to step to Yeah, he apologized. He did apologize. He apologized, like but she was not accepted, Alex. Gary, he who likes Mary Gary. That's who is, why, why, why couldn't the date be set up between them? That's who we really wanted. I always want to get out of her goddamn league. <laughs> oh, no. Well, you know, Gary, Judy makes a good point. I, I, hey, Judy, why is your daughter always laughing? That really bugs me, too. I've never been so humiliated in my life. Ask her why she's always laughing. I don't know. <laughs> I try to ask her that. <laughs> you know? I guess it's I better than crying. <laughs> oh, my goodness. She's on helium. What a family. The, the daughter's the porn star. She laughs. <laughs> she laughs at the mother and the grandmother. No respect. Well, Judy, uh, I'm, I'm waiting to hear Gary's yeah. apology. Yeah, I would like to hear it. Like like Mary, Say it again. Like Mary. Gary, sweet talk her a little. No, I don't want him sweet talking me. No, I don't want him sweet talking me. <laughs> Gary, don't right. listen. Just keep talking. Yeah, just tell, just, her, say, you're just tell her you're sorry, please. I'm sorry. I don't ever want to see the guy again. I'm sorry. Stop laughing. Stop laughing. Hit me. My mom just punched me. She's right. Why are you laughing at her every minute? We'd like to punch you. I'm not. I'm not laughing. I'm not I'm stupid. She won't let me. All right. Listen, this date has gone Gary, horribly. were you enjoying the date? I enjoyed it. But I'm not enjoying it. Oh. I've never been so humiliated in my whole life. What are about, though? Because you like me? Mary, why did you go on the date? <laughs> yeah, Mary. I, 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 first number one, let me tell you. I thought we were going to a nice restaurant. I thought all, I thought the whole crew was just going to a nice restaurant. I didn't know the whole stupid crew was going to follow us around with cameras in the park. I feel like a complete, complete fool. <laughs> well, I got to tell you. <laughs> I uh, I thought it was going to go... I, you know what? I didn't know what to think, Judy. I just thought that Gary was lonely, you were lonely, and I thought maybe it would be a good no, love night. I wasn't lonely. I said I don't care if I ever have a date. No. If, I live a, if I live to be 120 years old, I don't care if I ever have anybody. Right. Well, you were very gracious. You said you liked Gary. You thought that maybe there could be a love connection, but uh, obviously it didn't work out. Why do I want to say that I should have been stupidly honest? From the beginning. Right. You didn't like him from the beginning? I just didn't want to hurt his feelings. No, I mean, give, give me credit for that. Give me credit. Well, Gary, you've struck out again. You lost the daughter, you lost the grandmother, and you lost the mother. You lost three women today. You struck out on three bases. <laughs> you played it all wrong. You played it all wrong. You're out. Oh, no. You played it all wrong. Come on. You're definitely no ladies' man, Gary.
I am a ladies' man, but you know, <laughs> you know, since uh, you know, since so long since I've been with a woman, you know. Uh, I, I know. I mean? All right. Okay. All right, uh, Judy. Nice meeting you. I'm sorry it didn't work out. All right. And uh, Gary, I think you blew it. I think Judy would have been a good love match for you. Right. But uh, what can I say? You're going home to Oregon alone again. The heart wants what the heart wants. You know, who was it, Gary, that said life is like a box of chocolates? <laughs> Wasn't that a retard? <laughs> yeah, that was far as Gump. Right. All right, Gary. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Okay. I don't be quiet. He can have Mary Carey. He can have, he can have all she wants. All he wants. Are you mad at Mary Carey? I'm not mad. I, I, I just, it just burns me up that these stupid handicapped men always want to, always act like they're a God's gift woman, act like they could get the um, movie stars and the cream of the crop, the porn stars. I'm Mary. I'm not Judy. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Well, there you go. Oh, well. It didn't work out. I know everybody loves a follow-up to uh, love matches. And this is one of those that did not work out. This is it, not a love connection. It sounds like Mary does love being the center of attention. Yeah. Well, there obviously is some dysfunction in the family. Yeah. You think? <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, wow. Dr. Phil, you've hit on it again. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, and like Dr. Phil, uh, I can't solve anybody's problem. <laughs> very upset because I thought that my mom and Gary would be good together, but um, I guess not. So maybe next time my mom goes on a date, I won't meet the guy first. And... I'm not going to go on okay, no fucking maybe... date. <laughs> oh, oh my God, that is nice. This is this being recorded. <laughs> well, okay. Um, anyways, I'm just kind of sad that they didn't like each other. I thought they were going to get along really well, but um, hopefully my mom will find someone else. I don't know, maybe someone who stutters or something. I don't know. There's lots of guys out there. But... I just wish that they would have worked out because he's really nice. Gary's really sweet. I've always wanted to show a lot of you. Nice young man. Yay! <laughs>